Let's review how we would shelter in place and protect ourselves in a real emergency. First, we use the bathroom as our safe room because it has no windows and it's on the first floor making it easily accessible. Then we take our shelter in place kit into the safe room. Now the kit includes tape, some plastic sheeting for the door, a pair of scissors, a radio with extra batteries, and some emergency food and water supplies. We also have our plastic already cut and labeled. Well, that sure speeds up the process. Now, the first thing we need to cover is the door. We have to make sure all the edges are sealed with duct tape. While you do that, Tony and I can tape around the pipe. I'll tape under the sink and around the pipe that goes to the toilet. Great! And Christian can tape around the pipes in the shower. That's easiest to do with small pieces of tape. We also tape the electrical outlets and place a plastic sheet over the ceiling vent. Anywhere vapors can get into the room, we seal it. Then we listen to the radio for further instructions. Now the radio will give us updates on the situation and tell us when we should leave the safe room. Mom, shouldn't we keep taping? Yeah, if we keep taping, we'll be safer. Well, that's true, but it's more important to get a tight firm seal the first time. And finally, when the official order is given to end sheltering, we'll follow officials' instructions to vent the house or relocate to a reception center. That sounds like a plan.